We have been talking about it for a while now. Music's biggest night of the year is Sunday. The 60th annual Grammys will be in New York City. That's right. And our Astrid Martinez is live for us in New York ahead of the big event. She's at Madison Square Garden tonight. And Astrid, you talked to an artist who is trying to make it to the Grammys one day. That's right. We've been talking to a local artists all week from Atlanta about what their struggle, what it takes to get here on this big stage. But there's also local artists right here in New York who are working hard for that goal. And this story is a little personal to me. Check it out. Es una aventura andar bajo su blusa. With vulnerable lyrics and passion in his voice is how Nestor Martinez found a way to express his deepest feelings. Siento pena. But growing up shy, Nestor kept his talents to himself until he discovered Latino singing sensation Mark Anthony. And listening to his music, listening to a grown man be so vulnerable and so sensitive and so honest, it really inspired me. Nestor used that newfound confidence to audition for high school plays, and he was hooked. I felt so connected, and I saw how much power you can have when you're vulnerable to a character when you submit to it, and how much of an effect, how much magic it has on people. <laughs> Nestor's experience during his teen years make for quite a story, fitting for a man strongly influenced by his family and his heritage. Things that I've gone through in childhood, whether if it was with bullying or whether it was um, uh, just as a Latino, as a str the struggle, like growing up on welfare, the up and downs that we went through in our family. So I was just like, I really f found like this is a way I could tell my story. And it felt powerful. It felt right. It was the spark he needed to transform the singer-songwriter. Because she didn't feel the way that I do. In his 20s, Nestor auditioned for everything. Commercials, wedding singing, singing on cruise ships, traveling theater. Anything for that one opportunity to be noticed. Probably done over 500 auditions and, you know, you do this stuff, but in all, it's all like for that for that one yes. Dale un beso. Now in his early 30s is when Nestor is starting to land consistent work. I probably feel the most ready I've ever been in my life. And the singer says he will continue pouring himself into every performance until he makes a name for himself. Ultimately, so, would you love to be on a Grammy stage? Oh, yeah, definitely. Yeah, that would be like a dream come true. And if you couldn't tell, Nestor, if if you couldn't tell, Nestor is my baby brother, my youngest sibling. But while we wait to him to get here on this big stage, we have a list of artists that will be performing here tomorrow. We have you two, Rihanna, uh, Kendrick Lamar, Stone Mountain's own Donald Glover, and so many other presenters. So make sure that you stay tuned to us here so you can catch everything Grammys. For now in New York City, Ashton Martinez, CBS 46 News. Yeah, who knew? Mom so and dad are going to be happy tonight. Exactly. <laughs> that's so great that that's your brother. So talented. But Astrid, you have to sing for us now because clearly wow. it must run in the family. <laughs> All I can sing is bye. <laughs> that's it. I'm not the talented one. You that are very debatable. talented. All right. Yeah. Thank we'll, you so much, we'll Astrid. We'll give you a pass, Astrid. Thank you. <laughs> All right. Be sure to watch the Grammys on CBS 46. Our coverage begins right here. Uh, our, actually, our sister station, CBS 46, mm -hmm. is beginning at Sunday night at 6.30 p.m. And then make sure you join us after the Grammys for live coverage from Madison Square Garden on CBS 46 News at 11.